Good morning, afternoon or evening and welcome to match two in the Zero AD YouTuber battle between myself and Alistair Findlay. Now if you've not watched part one there, I think it's probably wise you go and check that out for some background. But if you can't be bothered to do that, then this is basically, just to give you an overview, three channels that are going to show the exact same match but from different perspectives. Two of which are going to be the two competitors who were playing in it, so they'll be commentating as they actually play the game. And one will be just commentating uh, with like an overview kind of thing. So those channels are mine, obviously, you're here watching this. Jim Cogan's Newbie Rush and Tasmania's finest, Alistair Findlay. So just to quickly go over the rules again, while the last match was random sieves, this game had us choose our faction, although inaccurately in my case, as you'll see. And we'll be playing a 200 max pop game on a small unknown land map. Again, that's by mistake. It was supposed to be small mainland and we'll have a random biome. So with that out of the way, let's have a look at it from my perspective and my commentary on the match as it was being played. Let's go. So uh, welcome to this. It's me versus Alistair. He's going to be recording as well. So he'll show the other um, side of this and I will show it from my perspective. I am the Romans and Alistair is uh, the, oh God, the, the Ptolemies. So I am going to have to go, wait a minute, I'm not the Romans at all. I'm the Athenians. Okay, well that's interesting. Right. Well, that changes everything. <laughs> I've now got a load of cavalry I didn't want. I, these were supposed to be, um, what do you call it? Uh, their mother cavalry people. Uh, I forget what they're called. Uh, they're supposed to be Lancer cavalry, um, which would have meant I could go and rush them. Um, now, that is not something that I can do, which is a bit disappointing, but never mind. Let's see how it goes anyway. So I'm going to have to build my first house pretty shortly. Let's get these guys in because they're going to have to go and do some kind of raiding to make it worthwhile. Um, although, actually, scratch that. There are goats back there. We're in luck. And really in luck. Um, those goats um, will make it um, worthwhile. That is incredibly fortunate. Um, so the goats just stand there when you attack them. So it's like having sword cavalry, um, which is a massive uh, bonus. So this is going to give me a great chance to boom. I can get, um, hopefully if these guys start really chopping the wood with enough. How many have I got there? So I got, yeah, it's mostly um, mostly women, but 100, that gives me sufficient already. Let's see if I can get, yeah, Storm House nicely in there, that's a good location. Got five women going in there. Ah, they didn't all. So, okay, let's just get the other five. But should have plenty of food. Ooh. Oh, I forgot it's unknown. This is unknown land, not mainland as well. This has been a bloody disaster. Not, I've managed to get the wrong faction, the wrong map, everything. I've completely messed this up. So if I somehow win, I'll be incredibly impressed with myself. Um, what are we looking at? Have we got, yeah. Get these guys going. Uh, I've managed to get myself housed as well, which is pretty ruddy poor. Um, the, oh, goats again. Fantastic. Those goats are an absolute godsend. They're keeping me... I've only got a few people with making food. And I'm really struggling for wood. But those guys are making it possible. Let's see these. Right. right. This is football. Now we're moving in the right direction. After those nine, I'm going to get another cavalryman as well. Hopefully, how well we got? 13 seconds on this. Here come the, here come the cavalry quite literally. Yes, 
need to build that um, fort. So he's, he's got a load of his cavalry there. So I need to now make some slingers, basically. And these guys. And hope really that this... Um, I'm okay with that. Let's just go to the far side. So his, his camels have come around, but they haven't really done anything. Um, the promising thing from my perspective is that it, because it's camel archers, there's not a lot he can actually do with them. He can't take over this tower, so I can defend with that. And what I really need... Here they come. Oh, if I can get this guy. No, come on, get in there. That's done it. These guys, can I go round? Oh, I can go round. This is interesting. Let's have a look. Right, the second. Oh, what on earth? How many of those cables are there? I lost at least one cavalryman. Let's go down here and then try and sort of come around a bit. And hopefully I can get yeah I can. That look this now looks like it can handle the camels pretty well. These are all women, okay. He has got a skirmisher, and the skirmisher is probably going to take out. Come on, get that woman. Lost another bloody thing. Oh, this is dreadful. And these guys, there's ten of you there. get some let's get this moving I need to really up the pace because this has been desperately poor right we should in a very short while be able to actually um, start ourselves properly getting on with producing some food come on do it These guys are doing well producing the stuff, but what I want to get is a load of people so I can start really pushing on with slingers. So now that's my aim. So we're 25 women, five fields, that is more than enough. But I am really short of stone, so I'm going to try and get some stone together. For these guys at sea, can I bring them out? Yeah, come on. My one re remaining cavalryman. Okay, so I need to get, I think, is it 100 and, what do I need for this, 150? Yeah, I need 150 stones, so I'm going to try to uh, up the pace here, but we're so short of um, food, it's becoming quite difficult. But I've got, let's get those guys getting the stones. If I can get the stone together, finally get a barracks, really start pulling out the... Uh, getting stuff going and now we're starting to see okay, what this is like. Come on. I need those houses built. And I've made no um, kind of not even the remotest sort of indentation into Alastair's thing, so he is going to be in a really, um, yeah, he's probably in a quite a strong position here. Come on, you guys, let's get some wood together, let's get this going. 
DLC. I really want to get sufficient um, wood to build a um, to build a barracks maybe around here or this sort of area. Where am I under attack from? I don't even know. Oh. And he's luckily he's cut off my food, admittedly, but at a point that um, it's not that much of a problem. Uh, I've actually got a fair amount. Maybe I'll, in fact, not maybe I am going to build a thing here and let's get these guys back. Yes, yes, yes. These guys can get that, then they can build another one here, then they can do that. So he's trying to mess me up a bit, which he has done in fairness. Okay, this is my opportunity now. Come on, people, don't die. Let's see what he thinks he can do here. As far as you say, I think if I come around there, then I'm just going to get the thing. It looks like he might have already aged up, which would be very good news for him if that's true. I've got my two towers. This one's actually garrisoned. He's desperately trying to cause me problems. But. These guys will cause more problems for him. Got one. Right. Let's put a tower in here and then let's put that there. This again, short of what's required, really frustrating. To, like, these guys go. Oh, geez, still got the alert going. That wasn't very bright. to get some food. The, the good thing now for these guys is that it's kind of set up about five. Oh look at that, it's five, that's perfect. Yeah. These guys are coming out here. It's not been a very good start. I've managed to get myself very much unbalanced. Only now starting to see uh, six wheels just about to go to seven. I've got quite pleased with that, admittedly. Could build another barracks around here. Come on. Ah, there we go. And once I have that barracks, I'm in a strong position. Uh, well, I'm not. I'm in a really weak position on the whole because I've just done pretty uh, badly, I have to say. And so I've got people here, I just need to let's get some wood. I need these houses. Do you know what? I think Alistair is probably 
moving towards phase three and I am still stuck back here. This is just dreadful. Come on. Oh. Come on. Three more wood. Oh. Oh. Unbelievable. I am three wood. Ah, finally we can go. Let's get ourselves to phase two and these guys. Give me some wood while we're at 140 houses. So what have I got here now? Seven fields seem to be eight. That's not too bad. I've got a decent supply of wood. Um, got stuff coming here, there and everywhere. Let's get these guys out here. Oh, I've got a barracks already. I forgot about that. So let's... Let's do what we want to see. Let's get you a market here. We can get back to this sort of... Stuff. Where's the... My cavalryman. So I got my... After those guys are gone, I'm going to get some more people out here. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. You as well. And I've actually managed to run out of food. It's becoming a bit of a farce, this, actually. Where am I under attack from? There, Alistair looks to be used. Are these actually chopping wood, or they just stood there? They just stood there. Ah, oh, I hate it when that happens. together. It's happened again. I managed to get myself housed just for the 40th time. Oh, I can start actually. At least I can get myself up to phase three hopefully relatively quickly and I'm trying to get as many people collecting metal as possible because that is going to be a big part of this. So let's make sure the metal is actually going to get, um, let's get these things moving. Right, yeah, it's metal that we're short of. What can I do? Oh my word. If I had some, uh, I actually had some food, I'd be in a great position. I'm really trying to get this metal going. Okay, Alistair's really coming in now. Is that going to be suicide or is that actually a really good thing? Well, he is certainly he's got an absolute shed load of those guys. So 
I think it's safe to say that his um, his spearmen are proving very difficult to um, to kill, and that is going to cause us an, a whole world of hurt. Like, wow, he's really got a lot of people here. I'm hopeful that I can actually fight him off because this is just ridiculous. And again, food is the problem. I've got bloody millions of buff. Oh, I've got more than enough farms, or should have. How is that not sufficient? This should also do... Having these... Oh my word, the towers, they're just getting themselves into all kinds of trouble. Everyone who's not a female citizen, come back. They should, or we should be able to take these guys out. Actually, he may have just overexerted himself. <laughs> That's my dream, anyway. just can't seem to get look at this absolute carnage he's doing it all under the tower as well Take out the cows and then get on with these guys. Okay. Flaming egg, that was a blimmin' difficult thing, wasn't it? Right, let's get some. Uh, where's some stone? Jesus, come on. Let's get the fortress up. These two guys are actually very, very strong, so they should be able to... Oh, you as well, stop it. Leave the guy alone. You're on your, all on your own, Black Cloak. So he's a Thracian Black Cloak. So they are very strong. And this woman as well has stopped collecting wood. I hate it when that happens. Luckily I've got plenty of wood so it's not really a problem, but nonetheless. I could do with building one of these as well, and then getting on with this. Is this woman still not chopping wood? Oh great, she's got herself trapped. These women here, come on. Right, I've got no stone. And oh, I've got an additional blooming stone there I didn't even know about.
Oh my word, come on you useless things. I badly need this stone like you would not believe. Come on. Let's get going. Get that. Stone moving. These women, no, they're slingers. And he's going for it again. He's sending. You got a fortress. Oh, he's going to elephant crush me. It's already done, I think. Looking at that, I just can't seem to get the bloody. Can't get the stone together to actually do anything about this, which is really annoying. Just come on, collect some flipping stone. Just do it, I need the stone. Here come the elephants, actually it's not all the elephants, but fur. This is me in massive trouble. So I can't. It's not a lot I can do. I've messed this up like you would not, well, like you would believe because you're seeing it. This is another absolute. Oh, it's a disaster. Quite what I'm doing, I've no idea. These guys should struggle there. But if he comes around this side and. Yep, he can cut that lot off. Actually, it is the. So it keep pulling them in because hopefully these things can do something. Ah, oh, these guys. Oh. The pikemen are so frustrating because they they don't they're just a meat shield. They don't really do anything. They can't actually cause much in the way of danger. They can't really cause, do much in the way of attacking. Come on, run, run to the tower. Ugh. And this, they're just going to take too long to appear. Don't actually have any more troops. Oh, this is such a desperately poor performance. Jesus, don't unpack, you useless things. You were actually set up and in a position to do... Stop it! Do not, under any circumstances, unpack. You can actually do something. But it's all done. It's been a disaster. There's been not one good thing that happened in this game. There. 
I'm trying to think of if I could have played any worse. That really wasn't ideal to not have the faction I intended to have. But look at that. What a disgrace. Absolute embarrassment. I'm, I'm deeply, deeply ashamed of what just happened. There's no excuse. No, yes, I picked the wrong faction, but the way that I played was just awful. Um, fair play to Alistair, though. Um, yeah, absolutely deserved the victory. Uh, and I should have been able to put up a fight, but that was just dreadful. Uh, so there you go. That's how we are. I thought I'd got to a point, actually. If we just look at the charts, there was a bit... Yeah, he just always had the advantage. I was either housed or I hadn't managed to sort out my food. Oh, it was just awful. Just awful. Okay, <laughs> thanks very much for watching. Cheers.